Despite claiming no direct involvement, there are still ethics concerns around President Trump's ties to his business. Here to comment are the co-CEOs of the Trump Organization, Eric and Donald Trump Jr. Thanks for having us, Colin. <laughs> it's great to have you. Yeah. Now, now many people, myself included, have concerns <laughs> that your father could use his position to help his former business. Yeah, I know. You mentioned that on the golf course last weekend <laughs> when I was beating you by nine strokes. You got to work on your short game, pal. I know. <laughs> but Eric and I did have a blast. I drove the golf car. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sure did, Eric. Well, remember, I told you this, pal, man. Remember? It's golf cart. Golf cart, not car. Cart with a T. T. There you go. <laughs> Colin, the Trump Organization is entirely in our hands. In fact, Eric and I recently celebrated the grand opening of a new Trump golf course in Dubai, which, Colin, was a smash success. I got a sunburn. <laughs> That's because you didn't want to wear your hat. It doesn't fit. I told you, bud, you can change the size with the little snaps on the back. Mm. That's why they have those. <laughs> we also cut the ribbon, the beautiful new Trump luxury hotel in Vancouver, Canada. And Colin, the chef we got in Vancouver is absolutely amazing. He crushed the menu. The food is next level. I had a funny face pancake. <laughs> he had whipped cream's hair. Yeah, and he ate the whole thing. I'm hungry. All right. I got some Cheerios for you, buddy. Oh, that's... <laughs> well, I'm glad your business is doing well. Uh, that doesn't actually answer any questions about your father's involvement in the business. I'm perfect. All right, got a juice for you. The fact of the matter is, Paul, all the deals coming to fruition now were in place far, far before my father, Eric, Eric, let me do it. Let me do it, Eric, Eric, come on, man. Don't just stab it, you're making a mess, man. Look, insert straw here, right? First of all, you're not using the pointy end. Sorry. Oh, Eric. What'd I do? You just gotta, okay. Eric, I don't wanna make a mess, right? There you go. Yeah, good. You guys got it, figure it out. That's my brother. Yeah, he's, he's good. That's great. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. <laughs> Call it bottom line. The only people making decisions. You down that quick, bud? Look at you. A thirsty little guy. Uh -huh. The only people making decisions regarding the Trump Organization are Eric and myself. A dad. No, no. <laughs> Remember. No, no. Remember, Eric? Dad does not tell us what to do anymore. Yeah, he does. Hey, you want to play, uh, you want to play on my phone, bud? Yeah. There you go. Uh, Eric's a little jokester. Uh, what he meant to say was the only people calling the shots at the Trump Organization are myself and this guy. I'm tired. Yeah, he's going to get cranky. We got to get him home. Okay, so it's quick bath, jammies, then bed. Okay, can Colin sleep over? Not tonight, bud. Aww. Aww. Eric and Donald Trump, everyone. Aww.